this uplifting cinematic experience. Uh, I've got something important to tell you, man. The big story is... Dig this and dig it deep. What if I had the power to gather all of my favorite MCs with the illest comic book characters and they became arch enemies? Inconceivable, unbelievable, yet as wild as it seems, the Emperor and Stan Lee will coach the two opposing teams. Keep it clean, no bats, no gats, guns, or interference. Comic book characters will go head up with raw lyrics. Now I take whoever might be on break from doing tours and have them sign up for the last Emperor secret war. Sure, for that kind of capacity, we need a crazy large arena that might stretch from West Philadelphia to East Medina. If I'm able, I'd put it on pay per view through my label and give free tickets to my neighborhood bums with no cable. Yeah, that sounds fat. Now that we've squared away the propositions, let's begin with the ultimate tough man competition. Want no cool tip? Aye, aye, aye. Uh, tip is gotta have discipline. If you're a comic book artist and you have a monthly grind deadline, you gotta have discipline. And when I'm talking about discipline, I ain't talking about just, you know, um, just meeting your deadlines on time. That's that's just like a little bit of it. That's half. Hell, not even half. That's quarter. Or 10% of 100. What I usually do is, when uh, I'm on a project, I wake up around 7 o'clock in the morning. I wake up, I go take a piss, wash my hands, cook breakfast, eat the breakfast. Oh shit, there's a new GTA coming out? And then buy 7.30, maybe 7.45, close to 8, I'm already at the drawing table. I'm at my art desk drawing. I'm drawing all the way to about probably about 12 o'clock. Now, when that 12 o'clock slide comes in, that's your lunch break. You eat your lunch, but that's not all you do. You have your lunch break and you do some exercise. I prefer you do your exercise first and then eat because you might have some accidents. You do your exercise because you're gonna be sitting at a desk for like nine out of nine hours out of your day. You're gonna get tired, you know. So and, and you're gonna gain some weight because you're eating. You're sitting at a desk. You're not moving around a lot. So do some exercise. Do some push-ups. I mean, run around your block. Uh, if you have a treadmill, that's good. Do some, you know, some pull-ups. Do something, something that keeps you moving, keeps the heart rate up. Because you don't want to just sit at your desk and get fat. And girls don't like that. And if you're if you're a girl artist, uh, there's some guys that like that. I'm just telling you, you know, it's good for health purposes, you know, stuff like that. From 12, after like, no, from 1 o'clock to like 6 o'clock, 6 or 5.30, you will be back to drawing again. From 1 o'clock to like 5.30, 6 o'clock, you will be drawing all the way then. By that time, you shall already have your page done and a page already mapped out for the next day so you don't have to just go in finish one page you know slouch about and just try to figure everything out the day after do a page and a half a day sketch out the next page for that day so that when you wake up the next day you'll have a page already because your editor does not want you to be late because that means that you're always late and you're unreliable you don't want the editor to think that because then that's gonna that's gonna be you missing out on a lot of jobs that would suck very bad next from 6 o'clock to 10 30 11 that is your time to go out and have some fun have a social life you know go talk to your friends go to a bar have a beer or two hell wake up next to a fat chick or a broke ass guy if you're a woman either way have fun have a social life you know cuz to be honest with you this this comic book stuff is gonna take over your life but at least you're getting paid for something you love. Just a side note, this is the picture that I was sketching up the other night. I finally finished it. No, I actually finished it yesterday. But this is it. You see, I mapped out all the compositions. I got my shading in. Got all my lines done. 
No. There you go. That's actually page number two. Finish. I actually do have page number one somewhere. Got to find it somewhere in my studio. Oh, yeah, there we go. This is actually page number one. The main character getting punched the hell out. It's page number one, y'all. I see how he, his eye, see that? He got punched so hard, man, tears start coming out his eye. <laughs> yeah, but that's page number one, as y'all can see. And page number two. So you can kind of follow what the hell's going on. All right, now I got to get back to work. Got to draw page number three. Deuces.